Today I attended my first ever web dev workshop. I having way less knowledge regarding web dev, I thought I will learn something there. I had free time so in my college so I attended that workshop uh, and we went over the concepts of HTML, CSS, JavaScript, front end, back end and API. Um, the thing is uh, most of it went above my head it wasn't uh, I would say very beginner friendly but at least uh, I think I, I mean Kuch to maine seekha. I learned something. I don't know what I learned, but I'm sure I <laughs> I learned something. So um, here's what we went over, at least what uh, went in my head. So there's a back end. Uh, he's the cook in the kitchen. There's front end. What you see in front of you of a web page, for example, you're watching YouTube so it contains components so the subscribe tab is probably a generic layout it's a component that is copy pasted in every youtube channel something like that and then this databases there's api application programming interface there's express.js node.js these are basically applications um, used in front end back end development there's one that application named as react um it has a lot of libraries i guess but it was made by the people at meta isn't that crazy like a company made it and now everyone's using it anyways then we moved on and also node.js is not a programming language it's a runtime environment which allows to allows you to run your code outside your browser in your computer isn't that crazy see i know it and you didn't know but now you also know that's what this is this this is coding diaries something like that then we went over to replit replit is like uh, which allows us to code in a browser <coughs> then we did we our aim was to create a note card like a note taking app so there were note cards there, then we added some button. It was basically connected to a GitHub repository, which is like a, like a huge document with a bunch of code in it. So the code was there and we were basically copy pasting what uh, the speakers were presenting in the presentation and trying to make sense out of it. Uh, then there was like a we read about buttons, text, on click, type, function, props, and what else did I learn? And routes, paths. These are just words that somewhat made sense to me. Objects, JavaScript. <laughs> this must must seem very really naive, but that's what I learned. But you know, uh, at least uh, yeah. Three three things I think I probably learned, there, which is which are probably functions. Fetch, which basically grabs data. There's async, which is like काम चलता रहता है उसकी वजह से जब तक data. Meanwhile, when in the mean in the process of grabbing the data, it allows other things to go to work and awaits is the function. It allows to wait for data. It it makes the function wait for data before moving on to the next step. I guess, yeah. So um, this was a, and then we ended up making a note a notes app which looked something like this. So that was that. We learned something, and um, even if it wasn't that deep or even if we didn't get the basic grab of basic concepts i think it, it allowed me to get familiar with some terms so the next time i'm properly learning this it would help plus uh, i was in a, with a bunch of coders right surely some knowledge i must have synthesized i just be at the right place at the right time experiment inspire and code so i'll keep you will 
stay tuned regarding this coding journey we'll do something we'll start learning some stuff i'll get back to you soon until then stay curious bye bye